thing with Fina is that when she expresses like how she has been wronged, it always it always rubs off some kind of way like she's not grateful for the platform that has made her who she is and and that's why i have a problem i don't have like i mean she can come out to say that she has not been paid or not which rubs off bad on multi-choice but i think that the way fina expresses herself sometimes it makes people not take what she's saying seriously it makes people doubt the truth in her statements and was well, that if, fair on if, her though it's not fair on her but i think fina is at a point where she doesn't just need to come out to say anything she's a brand at this point she does not need to take her phone and go live and say whatever that comes out of her mouth i really like fina i think she's great she's very talented but she needs better management to be honest she needs she needs a better way of presenting herself online that's why i feel and if they've not paid that, did you pay up? Guys, to be quite frank, the way some people jump into issues and start giving their opinion and hot take, most times you just be asking and wondering to yourself, is it that these people did not really get to the root of the issue and find out what the whole thing is all about before giving their opinion? Or they are just giving their opinion because it is a particular individual that they know that a lot of public or a lot of people in the public would just want to, you know, make caricature of the person or talk bad about the person. Like the young lady that was saying that she feels that it is the way Fina presents her matter on social media. That's why people do not respect her. That's why people will always think that she is lying. This one and that one, blah, blah, blah. Guys, honestly speaking, I was just asking myself, like, is that lady expecting Fina to come on social media and start crying and start rolling on the floor before? In fact, honestly speaking, even Fina, like, let her come on social media and start crying, rolling on the floor, speaking about how people are seriously dealing with her. Nobody is going to believe that because they have already hated the gear for no just cause. And I don't really know the reason. In fact, the young lady even went as far as saying that it's as though Fina is not appreciative of the platform that brought her to limelight. Then, in conclusion, she now said, yes, if they have not paid her, they should go ahead and pay her. Like, guys, the kind of confusion in some people's head it is always alarming like fina even went ahead to say during that live that see she tried reaching out to multi choice she tried contacting them for them to give her all her winnings and they kept tossing her around they kept playing her as football and they do not end jail they were threatening her life they were making life miserable for her doing a whole lot of things to frustrate her Guys, even the people that Fina won Big Brother show before they came on the show to win, I am talking about Elebaye and Kosi, they have already gotten all their winnings. People that are judging Fina for asking of her win, is it that they do not hear that Elebaye and Kosi, Toala that won Big Brother Titan, they all said that they have received all their winnings why are they not even asking these people what did Fina do to them that they do not want to pay her all her winning as well is it that they are looking at Fina as less of a person or what because if they are giving their winners all their win why is it that they do not want to give Fina her own win but someone is coming out on social media to say Fina should have done this she not have done that meanwhile they have said with their mouth that they are blacklisting Fina. They are not going to be using her in anything they are doing. So, I think the important question should have been, what did Fina actually did to these multi-choice people? What did she do to these multi-choice people that is making them, you know, to treat her as though she is less of a person? Guys, that should have been the important question. Anyways, let's quickly go right into the gist of this particular video. If you're not subscribed to my channel, kindly do where to subscribe to this channel. Click on the notification bell button. And do not forget to like and share this video with your friends and loved ones that likes Big Brother Gist. Guys, honestly speaking, at this particular point in time, I really think that someone should really ask the one, what did Fina did to him that is always making him to masturbate on Fina's case all the time like ladies and gentlemen just look at some of the things he actually came out today to talk about fina and the movie she is producing in fact the major reason why i'm talking about this is basically because of some of the things the one has to say about the movie that fina is producing 
Just watch this particular clip. Less than a year, yes. I fully entered. It's not even up to a year. Fina, leave this failed comedian now. Because you don't fail, you know, leave him. Leave this failed guy now. Okay, now, let me juggle your memory. You know, you know, say you don't go to university. So that time you did secondary school, eh? That time maybe you SS, maybe you do GC or something. I don't win competition for this comedy. Mm? As a failed comedian, the first Alibaba spontaneity, they give me brand new car, brand new car. Eh, you understand? They give me, I don't call them out. They give me. <laughs> anyway, uh, you talked about my family. Say, my family will not be each up. At least, we know each up, we know they beg. Eh, at least, my papa no call me out online. Say, you know, if you me, you say. <laughs> so, you now, nah, you go call yourself. Hi, Puma, you don't fail. Even for the hype industry, they don't know you. Wait, okay, what do you, what do you, what do you contribute for the hype industry? Who they? Who they? Now you contribute. Who they? <laughs> you go cover hype now. Nah. You go act film. Who accepts you as producer? Because I've, I've called most people that I know as producer. They said they don't know you. They say, who register you? <laughs> I swear. Eh, I swear. My name is D1. Your film no sell. Eh, you can't jump this process. Oh. You don't know the I don't pay my deals. You can't jump your film. If he say my bell, you <laughs> he say go sing. Not be so white money, does it? <laughs> ah! You people are you are you are they crazy. No real value. Now nah, everywhere don't read now and I don't sell everywhere. <laughs> you were with condom, they give infection. <laughs> Guys, to be quite frank, the way this guy has been on Fina's case all the time, dragging Fina. In fact, if Fina curve, the guy will carry it and drag her left and right, front and back. I really think whoever that is advising this guy, whoever that is, you know, very, very close to him, whether it is his wife or his girlfriend or someone that he wants to marry or his family member, they should please advise him to stay clear, to just stay and mind his business because the way he always goes about dragging in fact could you imagine him saying that uh, Fina is not known as a producer anywhere in Nigeria that he has made his call and do this one and that one blah 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 he did not even end there he went as far as saying that the movie that Fina is producing it will not say it will not do this one it will not do that one guys who does that okay you said that she is not a producer nobody knows her as a producer she is not even among the producer what you want you want in in nigeria we've heard that what is the essence of you cursing her saying that a movie will not say it will not go viral it will not do this it will not do that uh-uh like honestly people should be coming down or like the way people do on this big brother street they should just be coming down most especially this the one first it was between the one and white money because he wasn't really trending the way he wanted to trend with white money he is now facing fina guys honestly it is quite irritating and this is where i'll be ending this particular video go ahead let me know your thoughts subscribe to the channel click on the notification bell button and do not forget to like and share this video